Hey everybody, it's Jen from the Planner Chickie. I am, I don't want to say hacking because it's not really a hack, it's just, I wanted to make a dashboard for my traveler's notebook, or as Michaels likes to say, traveler notebook. You only get to go one place, one place for the month of July. <laughs> anyway, I'm doing one book July, I'll link below. Um, I'm actually going to segue off of this little project for a second and I'm going to tell you about Romani's Realm. And I'm going to link her video below because Honestly, she opened my eyes because she just posted a video of what the rules are for One Book July. And there are no rules. You do what works for you. Um, so it's supposed to be back to basics planning, if you will. That's my interpretation of it. Um, I am going to use one pen. I'm going to use one planner, except for work. I feel like that's on the side, though. I just I, There's not a planner big enough to hold something that would carry for both. Anyway, um, but there's, if you want to do all planning, go ahead. If you want to do journaling, go ahead. Like, I'll link it below. She explained it so much better than me. She's a little bit more eloquent than this girl. So let's get to why I decided to drag out the video camera. Um, in my traveler's notebook, I found while using, oh, sorry, shook that hard. There's no real dashboard for me to use. Like, if I stuck things here, it's a little slick, so it would probably be okay. But if I stuck things to this one, no, it would pull it, it would rip the paper. So I'm trying to keep it cool. So I thought self measuring a notebook, I can't get with the insert, so let's just move past that. We're going to call these notebooks. And I measured it with my handy dandy ruler and I put the width and then I measured it this way and I wrote on the ruler the length. I write a lot of things on the ruler. Um, then I measured out a piece of paper and then I measured out another piece of paper, put some what is it called? It's called something. It's called uh, upside down. Removable adhesive from Tombow. Oh, they're in Thailand. I didn't know that. Anyway, Michael's got that one. I'll link that below if you're interested. Um, but it works great because I can peel the paper open and reposition it and it works fine. So I put those two together and then I did my best in measuring from this to this to try and keep it all even. I do have some dots in here from the, the adhesive just to keep everything straight when it goes through. So I'm gonna put it through. Wait, sorry. I'm gonna put it through right now. And while I'm over here doing that, because I can't do that on film because it's way over here and the tripod will make you dizzy. Um, but I was trying to mimic that insert. Now I'm saying insert. We just agreed we would say notebook. Um, you see the accessory right there where their stickers are? It opens up into a zip pocket on the other side and then three credit card slots there. So I was trying to figure out the width right here because that's what I need to go under one of the notebooks. So I think I got the measurement right. I'm not 100% sure. I did leave a bigger gap because that is plastic and it's moldable. This is more laminated paper kind of stiff so I'm just going to push this through one more time to make sure it's good I did put it on my scotch laminator on 5 ml just is it ml or m yeah ml just because I want it to be a little bit thicker and stronger okay so here it is oh no oh shoot I may have to do it over because I decided in the beginning to try a glue dot and you'll understand it's right there. Can you see that lump? Maybe you can't see it. I can see it. Yeah, you can see it. Looks like it's got chicken pock. And I double sided it so it would be cute. I'll just wing it for now and see if it works. So, this is how big it should be. Now you can see the gap that they've got versus the gap that I've got. It's quite, quite, quite much larger. Good use of the English language. So, that is my little project for you guys. So, I'm going to just trim it up um, on a, a contact. I like lamination, excuse me. I like to round the corner, so I mimicked it already on the pages. And then I'm going to do that, and that's it. So, I will see you for the next video. Look at me doing a five-minute video. I would cut it and everything and then show you the project, but I don't know how to pause and then re-record, pick up right where I was. I need somebody to teach me, please. Editing 101 for dummies. Oh, maybe I'll go get that book. Huh, I just thought of that. 
Anyway, I hope you guys have a good one, and I will see you next week. Happy 4th of July.